the primary job of insulin in a layman's language is to digest the sugars and thereby control it. So if there is lack of insulin, the sugars are not digested and they rise in the blood. And then of course they are sent out through the urine. So insulin is the predominant hormone. Now interestingly, some fat people have high insulin levels, then why they are diabetic? Because even those high levels cannot suffice in their body to control the sugars because of something called insulin resistance. Insulin cannot act the way it should. So pancreas make more insulin, more insulin, a time comes when they get tired of being flogged and they reduce insulin production. So the levels may be high from the general population's perspective, but they are high for that individual patient, which we call relative deficiency. So absolute deficiency, which is negligible in the body and relative, which is excess but can't act. Both these two reasons can cause diabetes.